So I'm out here getting myself mentally ready to do a strenuous outside TRX workout that my wife has put together for me, and she's an evil genius when it comes to this stuff, so I am going to be very, very, very tired here in about an hour. Um, but I'm sitting here thinking, get myself in, in the right headspace, and work is still on my mind, and I'm just wondering why none of you guys can show me why we shouldn't be actually trying to help people get healthier. Like, why we shouldn't be encouraging people to be outside, running around, putting video games down for a little bit every single day and trying to get outside, you know, touch grass and stuff like that, you know? Like, why we shouldn't be doing these things. Like, why there's not some precedent. Like, I want compelling scientific data showing me that us increasing in body weight as an average, as a you know, society is somehow beneficial to our societal health. I want somebody to kind of justify the complete ignorance that we're having with this stuff. Like, it is amazing to me. We are literally talking about impeding on people's lives again. It's a year and a half later. We have known that being uh, obese and having really shitty lifestyles was bad from the beginning. We had that data from the very beginning, and instead of addressing the high-risk population, because most of you are sloths and uh, gluttons, um, we somehow or another ignored that, made obese people a protected class almost. Like, you can get banned for calling somebody fat. Um, they, they will come and try to cancel you if you say that woman needs to lose weight. Tess Holliday, Lizzo, and anybody else on the cover of Cosmo for the it, It's Healthy episode. Like, you can clearly look at people and know they need to lose weight. We need to stop with this fantasy because I'm really at the stage where I wish any of you, any of you fat acceptance people or people just want to hate on me, any of you produce evidence on how society is okay with this level of disease from lifestyle choices and how it will still be okay later when we have new viruses in the atmosphere and stuff. Like, I just want to hear the justification from anybody from the fat acceptance community, from the White House, from Congress, for anywhere. I want to hear the justification of why we aren't at least trying to inform and save some people's lives by helping them get healthier from not just the pandemic, but everything. There's no consorted effort to get people healthy at all when there's no, never been more important reason because we can only operate in society if everybody feels safe. So we need to make people feel more safe. Like, it's, it, you got to pick one. If you want to justify all this stuff and still be able to justify that people can be obese, I'm going to need to see some data to actually back up the ridiculous statement.